A lot of people here in Yerevan and tourists love the city center because it's such a walkable city. You can get from one area to the other in less than 20 minutes. But imagine walking all the way from Malaga to Yerevan. This gentleman here, Ignacio Dean Maulia, did just that. Ignacio, welcome to Yerevan. Thank you very much. How long did it take you to walk all the way to Yerevan? Five months and a half. Why? Why do you, would you walk to Armenia? Yeah, well, it's uh, it's my dream, and I think it's a very interesting country, mm -hmm. uh, and I am very interested in knowing about people, culture, history, and so I decided to walk through Armenia in my route. So you have a route. You're gonna go somewhere else from here. Yeah, next country is Iran. Okay. Then India, ba Bangladesh, Myanmar. Thailand, Malaysia, that's the end of Asia, and I will keep on walking by Australia, America, and Africa. So you're telling me, you, a 32-year-old from Malaga, you're walking all around the world by yourself? Yeah, alone. And how long does, uh, how many months, how many years does this take? Yeah, I think maybe five years, but I'm walking quite fast, so maybe, I hope, it takes me three years. So, what about uh, a career, girlfriends, university, you've left all of that to walk around the world? Yeah, yeah, really, and I, I fight because I study in the university, I study advertisement and public relations. I had no girlfriend, no wife, maybe if I was married I couldn't do this, or maybe she could, could came with me. Uh, yes, I leave my things there in Spain till I come back. Why are you doing this? Uh, it's a personal dream. I think we are lucky to be alive, and the meaning of life is to fight for your dreams, for me. So it's something I want to do in my life, walk around the world, and I also send a message of conservation of nature, nature conservation. So I decide walking is the best way, the best means of transport to show this message. So you're also doing public relations while you're w making this walk? You're talking about environmental issues with media and, and organizations like us? Yeah, yeah. So I think this trip is my personal campaign for environment. Let's talk about the technical difficulties here. How many miles or how many kilometers do you have to walk a day to get all around the world in five years? Uh, more or less 30 kilometers per day. 30 kilometers yeah, a day? It's 50,000 kilometers, the whole route. Mm -hmm. And five years, more or less, is that the average. But I'm walking maybe 40, 45 per day. So you're talking about the equipment that you have. What do you have to take with you to be able to make this trip possible? Uh, well, the camping stuff, as I told you, is a camping a tent, sleeping bag, uh, and camping gas. I also have a communication set, it's a computer, a mobile, a camera, 
Uh, well, water. There are some desertic areas in the world. I need five or ten liters of water, uh, food, first aid, um, but something else. A notebook I write. I want to write a book at the end of this trip and uh, my documentation, passport. Uh, that's more or less what I carry with me and clothes, of course. And so do you know people in each city and location or each country that you arrive at or do you make contact ahead of time? Yeah, well, I don't know people everywhere. I walk in. I contact them by Facebook uh, and, or the social nets or maybe by telephone. Uh, doing interviews also for media is a good way for me to send this message of conservation of planet Earth and contact with people. So maybe I, I know some people, but not all I meet in my way. And I'm very lucky because I, I have the luck to know very good people who open the doors of their houses and quite often from their hearts. As I walk, people tell me what's the best way. So not the most conflictive or the most dangerous, they show me what's the best way to, for me to walk. And maybe they introduce me more people in the next city or in the next country. So when I start from Spain, there were many things I didn't know and I do, I'm doing them as I walk. So people can follow your journey online. Tell us about your website. Yeah, it's www.earthwidewalk.org. And from there, there is link to Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, other social nets. Um, that's the window for this trip where I show the every step of my trip. Very well said and uh, good luck to you. Thank you very we'll much. We'll follow you along the journey and hopefully we'll see you again back in Armenia someday. Thank you very much. If I come back, it will be a very good signal. I, f I finished my trip and it's a good, a good feeling for me to be here. Okay, Ignacio, thank you very much. Thank you.